Then Joshua sent two men secretly as spies, saying, Go and view the land, especially Jericho. Uh, so the men went and entered the house of Rahab and spent the night there. The king of Jericho sent orders to Rahab, saying, Bring out the men who have come to you who entered your house, for they have come to search the, out the whole land. For Rahab took the two men and hid them. True, the men came to me, but I do not where they ca know where they came from. Rahab had brought them up to the roof and hid, hidden them with the stalks of flax that she had laid out on the roof. Before Joshua's spies went to sleep, Rahab said, I know that the Lord has given you the land and that dread of you has fallen on us and, all, and that all the inhabitants of the land melt in fear before you. For we have heard how the Lord dried up the water of the Red Sea before you when you came out of Egypt and what you did to the two kings who were beyond the Jordan. As soon as we heard it, our hearts melted and there was no courage left in any of us because of you. The Lord your God is indeed God in heaven above and on earth below. Now then, since I have dealt kindly with you, swear to me by the Lord that you will in turn deal kindly with my family. Give me a sign of good faith that you will spare my father and mother, my brothers and sisters, and all who belong to them and deliver our lives from death. I say to you, our life is for yours. If you do not tell this business of ours that we will deal kindly and faithfully with you when the Lord gives us the land. If we invade the land, tie this crimson cord in the window through which you let us down. Gather into your house your father and mother, your brothers, and all your family. Stay inside. If a hand is laid upon any who are with you in the house, we shall bear responsibility for your death, for their death. According to your words, so be it. Rahab sent them away, and, de and they departed. Uh, then she tied the crimson cord in the window. On the seventh day, they rose early at dawn and marched around the city seven times. The people shouted and the trumpets were blown. The wall fell. Uh, the wall of Jericho fell down flat. Uh, the people charged straight ahead into the city and captured it. Uh, the young men who had been spies went in and brought Rahab out along with her father, her mother, her brothers, and all who belonged to her. They brought all her kin kindred out and set them outside the camp of Israel. Rahab with her family and all who belonged to her, Joshua spared. Her family has lived in Israel ever since, for she hid the messengers whom Joshua sent to spy out Jericho.